Hello, I'm Ian Ridley, and this Take a Seat presentation is for the Ergo Select Spark Chair. This is the Ergo Select Spark Chair. It's the high back with Ergo Seat arms and a nylon base. There are other options available. I have one here, which is the mid back with a compact seat, but I'll do a presentation on the, the most standard of chairs, which is the Spark high back with Ergo Seat. It's a three lever mechanism, back, seat, and gas lift. Here we've got a seat depth adjustment. So to set up the chair and to adjust it, on the right hand side of the back, you've got the lever that releases the back angle. You can set that angle to one that suits you, lock it into place. At the same time, whilst you're adjusting the back, you would set the height of your lumbar, which is done by using the ratchet back height adjustment, and you set that so that the lumbar's in a good position for you. One of the great features about the spark is you then have the ability to adjust the lumbar as well for shape. So by pumping with the lumbar pump, you can pump the back up, that alters the shape around the lumbar area. If it's overinflated, you can release it and set it back to zero, pump up again. So you can get the back really comfortably set for yourself. The other part of doing that is you can also set the seat depth. So by having the seat too far forward, for me, um, I have to sit a long way back. It's, it's, I'm getting pressure behind the knees. So for me, I would have the seat set at the moment all the way back. My back's upright. I've got good lumbar support. Then I have the ability with the second lever to alter the whole angle. So here, if I want, if, I, if I'm reclining and I want to have a foot rest, I could, I can lock it in place or leave it floating. I can have it horizontal, again, lock it, or I can have the chair so it's leaning forward slightly. When you're leaning forward slightly, generally raise it up a little bit. Get your hips above your knees, and that opens up your hip angle, better posture. The seat that's on this is a molded polyurethane. It's three densities, so you're getting a really good comfort sit. But also when you bring the chair to its fullest and you allow the seat angle all the way forward, you can sit up really high, almost at a, you know, the, the prop height for a sit-stand desk. The, sh the chair is designed that you can do that. Most people, however, sit in the chair in its normal attitude, somewhere down here. You can leave it unlocked, um, and it's quite comfortable to actually have the chair follow you around as you're moving, uh, but that's personal preference. Again, once you've locked it in, you've got a chair that's set, you've got adjustable arms, height adjustment, width adjustment, so you can set the width of the arm, the height of the arm, once you've got the width set, tighten it back up again. So that's really the features and functions of an Ergo Select Spark Chair. I have here the mid back and the high back. This is an Ergo seat, this is a compact seat, there are four seats available. We've got the standard Ergo seat, we have an extra large seat, we have a compact seat, and there's one in between which is the square seat. Similar size, but without all the contours. So you can create a lot of different models with an Ergo Select chair. You can get it without a seat slide, and there is a four lever mechanism. That's shown on another Take a Seat presentation. So thanks for watching. That's a Take a Seat presentation on the Ergo Select Spark chair. If you have any questions, contact us. We'll see if we can help. Thank you.